It's your boy King Brando. What's up, Brando fam? How you doing? Yesterday, I was tired. Well, not like sleepy tired. I was just, you know, wanted to chill, wanted to rest. So, uh, yeah, took the day off yesterday. But we back today with another anime review. Or, I mean, not review, another anime reaction. You guys told me that you loved it so much, that you liked it, that you wanted to see more. So I figured, you know, we were stretching into a two-week thing, okay? Um, so, yeah. Right now, we're going to do a top 10 anime betrayals. So that's the good people turning bad or the bad people turning good. Whichever one you learn. You know, you just betraying people or whatever, I guess. Uh, yeah, so let's get into this reaction video. Make sure you guys like this video right now and hit that subscribe button. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Just so you know, I have a. You know what? I'm not even gonna say what I got in my mouth. It's just Jolly Rancher. I mean, I just said it. Yeah, I'll get what I mean. The sentence just didn't sound good, okay? This list isn't just dedicated to the bastards who screw people over, but the overall betrayal as a whole. We're putting emphasis on betrayals the audience wasn't expecting. Over betrayals we all knew were coming. You and I will be parting ways. We're that excluding was a good betrayal. Supernatural powers, as those types of betrayals are unintentional. And you know, just to cover our own backs, we're issuing a spoiler alert. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let's get it. Sailor Uranus and Sailor Neptune join Sailor Ooh, Galaxia. Sailor Moon. I always wanted to watch that. There's a lot of people I know that watched Sailor Moon before, so yeah. Talk about upping the watch that. series finale. Sailor Uranus and Neptune joining the villainous Galaxia is bad enough, but to watch them pummel the scouts that hadn't been killed and kill Pluto and Saturn is heart crushing. Oh. Not just because they're allies, but because they're practically Saturn's adoptive parents. Damn. I don't even know what Sailor Moon is about, so I'm kind of lost. But I know that's the good person. But I'm gonna watch that though. That's on my list too. Galaxia off guard and inevitably leads to the two betrayers being killed. Oh. Can we just go back to the simpler days of Sailor Moon crying her villains away again? <laughs> She really cried her villains away. Archer wants to kill what? himself. Fate stay night. Unlimited blade works. How long? Most characters from an alternate timeline want to change the course of history. Archer is no exception, but his methods and motivations are a bit of a doozy. He leaves his master, Rin, because he thinks Castor has a greater chance of winning the Holy Grail War. Welcome, yes, yes. Welcome to life. <laughs> Wait for it. Archer People make you cry. Character, Shiru, because Archer is Shiru. Archer, for lack of better words, wants to kill himself. <laughs> Number eight. But the same person, you know, you just, yeah, like you take it yourself. Monte Cristo. Excellency. <laughs> Alexandre Dumas's classic novel is known for being the ultimate tale of revenge. The anime adaptation adds a vivid sci-fi flair while keeping all of the brutal backstabbing intact. So from the beginning, you're only just using me. That's Pretty bad. much. I'm Another thing. Welcome to life. People use you, bruh. You obviously want the count to win. He was imprisoned for false charges while the love of his life unknowingly married one of the men who betrayed him. So yes, we're rooting for him. And feel guilty for cheering so loudly. Uh -huh. Are they jousting? We're torn between wanting these people to suffer and feeling bad for what they and their families go through. Your Excellency, if you don't mind, I'd really like you to join us for dinner after you've had a chance to meet my parents. Number seven, 
Eddie Leonhart is the female Titan. Attack, Attack on Titans. This was dope. Because when they found out, it was so wrong. She turned that type, it was bussing. It was the female type intensity in a series that, let's face it, already had us on the edge every episode. And that it was kind of bogus when she turned into the, like that little crystal thing. Murder quite a few characters. Whatever she like made her body like impenetrable. In Titan form, she's finally defeated. Mm. While there are clues pointing to her identity, and the others pray that they're wrong. That's raw though. She had the thing to um, make herself become a Titan. Rache betrays the Dragons of Heaven, X-1999. It can't be. They should have a Reiner and Berto, um, it's hard to betrayal on that too. Damn it, Rache gives it a good try. Sarata, the lovable hero that he is, says that it's his destiny to die for the woman he loves. Some will look at you with interest or affection, and some with animosity, and... Someone will love you very much. Rashi ignores him at first, but the two do end up growing closer. Later, Sarata is severely injured, but keeps the smile on his face since Rashi is okay. This solidifies Rashi's decision to leave the group and join the opposing side. Because That's if he's killed, Sarata has no reason to die for her, right? That's right, Missy. I knew you were the one. The first time I ever laid eyes on you. <laughs> the one I'll sacrifice my life for. Sad. Number five, Aizen betrays the Soul Society. Bleach. Bleach. I have no choice, but I'll take your feelings into consideration. Never, ever trust the quiet ones, especially. Yeah, I really don't. This, this, once well respected. This video character, was just no spitting out life facts. Turn in his character, not just because of the gentle smile, but because he was kind of, well, murdered. Whoa. Ah, that's impossible. His lieutenant, Momo, was overjoyed to see that he was actually alive, only to be stabbed by him and left for dead. At least after his evil oh. review, he ditched the glasses and trusting appearance as he spoke of plans to stand on top of the world. The Soul Reaper has to become a hollow. Yeah. Number four, Satsuki betrays... I'm watching Bleach. I don't care. Okay. I am Ragyo Kiryuin. And kill the kill, too. <laughs> the aim. At the start of the series, we're pretty confident that Satsuki, sorry, Lady Satsuki, is the main villain. Not just from Ryuko's assumptions, but from the fact that she's made resting bitch face into a way of life. There's a lady <laughs> trying to get changed here. Get out, you peasant! However, as the series progresses, we finally meet its real antagonist, Satsuki's mother, Ragyo. There's plenty of reason to despise her, but for the sake of this list, we'll point out how she's been taking pleasure in molesting her own daughter for years. Now sit back and relax. And I'll purify you. Uh, we've never been chill, so chill, chill. Like little back stab. <laughs> chill, chill, chill. <laughs> Rethinking the kill and kill part. <laughs> base contract. Puella Magi, Nadoko Magica. <laughs> Isn't Kube the cutest? And he'll grant you any wish you want, as long as you sign his contract and become a magical girl. <laughs> who wouldn't want to have their wishes granted? Us. Us and anyone who's seen this series. Kube is a sadistic, unfeeling creature who tortures these girls while rolling around like a kitten and eating his own remains. That's dirty. The worst part is that, technically, he did give everyone what they wanted. He just failed to mention the soul-sucking torment. <laughs> That's some nasty stuff. Number two, Anthe stabs Utena in the back. Literally, revolutionary girl Utena. Hey, these animes used to be real lit. Won't get too many betrayals now. be a prince. Anthe is treated like a tool, even by her brother. Together, these two young women form a bond that goes beyond the connection between a prince and a princess. Miss Utena, the truth is that I. What is it? Never mind. It's not just a matter of friendship. It's a matter of Utena being the only one who's ever treated Anthe as a living, breathing person. You <laughs> do. And after we finally feel like Anthe has made some progress, Chill. she stabs Utena, the only person who cares about her, in the back. That's bonus. 
What's the explanation? Before we reveal our number one betrayer of trust, Ow. let's have a look at some fun. They should have put that on now. For real. They should have put that on now. Big brother! Itachi! Father and mother are both... That was when uh, Sasuke was a little, a little My name bit. is Valetta Mew, and I am a Knight of Honor of Britannia. Mm. This child is mine! What a chainsaw! Too late for that! How disappointing! What use do I have for you if you're just another woman? What are you doing, Yui? Why betray me? Why, she asks? That takes a lot of nerve. I know you never really considered me your best friend. Those were just hollow, empty words. Really, Jean? You are a condemned man. Am I supposed to entrust a prisoner with Guru Lagan when he might escape in it? Oh, you son of a bitch! Well, then just wire me with a whole bunch of explosives! Number one, Griffith becomes Femto for Zerk series. What is that? The gifts that await you at the summit of your bloody quest. Your comrades, each a feather in your wing, have carried you to your great cause. After Griffith's dreams are shattered by a king who loves his daughter in a way that, well, nobody could have expected, Griffith is left to rot away in the deepest, darkest dungeon. <laughs> when his loyal band, led by Casca and Guts, risks everything to rescue him, Griffith is finally given the opportunity to fulfill his destiny. However, offers from a demon don't come cheap, and Griffith agrees to sacrifice his lifelong friends and companions to transform himself into a demon king. What the heck? Enjoy he this hollow feast and all that's What ugly? And you, our disciple, you are the chosen one. Probably the most tragic part is that the band, unaware of what is really happening, are still trying to protect Griffith, oh, even bogus. as they're being torn apart. <laughs> This is how the anime ends. That's it, that's all. Oh, that's even more bogus. How could you do that? Do you agree with our list? Which anime do you think uh. we betrayed by leaving off of our list? For more trustworthy top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to watchmojo.com. Man, final thoughts. I think I can make a better one than this. But I mean, this still has some good stuff. Uh, but yeah, final thoughts right now. Man, I feel like I can make a better one than that. I feel like I can just, you know, on my anime experiences, make a better list of betrayals than them. So, you know what? I'm going to do it. Be on the lookout for the next uh, one of these anime uh, reactions and stuff. I'm going to post my top anime betrayals in there on that one because I feel like I can do better than them. But they did have some good moments. Uh, a lot of moments that I knew, a lot of moments that I didn't know. Most of them I did know. I like the honorable mentions and uh, the stuff previewing at the beginning, I feel like they should have put that on there. Uh, it's like all the times, you know, they don't put your favorites on there, but they put ones where you like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, yeah. But, yeah, it's been your boy King Brando. Outro time. Uh, if you're returning to the channel, you should already know what to do. Like this video right now. Comment other stuff you want me to react to and do all that other stuff. But if you're new to the channel, you got to do this thing called the three clicks, man. You're going to join the Brando fam after you do it, bro. You just have or sis, whoever, whoever's watching. Uh, yeah, you just have to like this video. Hit that subscribe button and hit them post notifications. And you're the Brando fam. That's it. That's, that's, that's really all you have to do. But, yeah, it's been your boy. King Brando. Peace. Yeah. Take me to the truth.